the way legs through that biscuit was like some different. Some I ain't never even saw it before. And then the way she walked off, like she ain't even did it. This girl walked off like nothing happened. Not a nothing. I mean, and didn't sprint, didn't run, didn't fast walk, fast pace, none of that. She walked off. Soon as Jazz felt the biscuit hit her, Fuku the biscuit broke open. So I was like, that's that's new. I ain't never seen that before. The biscuit broke open. She like, who hit me with a biscuit? Right? Who threw that biscuit? So she snapping, right? You just see it. She didn't came out the line. So she popping off. She's looking at me. She somehow locked eyes with me. But hold on, Steven. I'm all the way in the back of the line. I'm at the very end of the line. I ain't did nothing. Okay? I'm just a fly on the wall. I ain't did nothing. She like, I know somebody saw some who threw that biscuit. So she snapping. So the security girl like, hey, 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 what's going on? She like, somebody saw something. Somebody saw something. So she like, so the security girl like, hey, calm down. Tell her to calm down. So she like, somebody threw a biscuit at me. Who threw it? Did you see it? So now she asking people that was behind in the line with her. Now, mind you. It's some people that saw legs throw that biscuit. I even saw legs throw that biscuit. The person that she took the biscuit off the, the, the plate saw she threw that biscuit. Nobody said nothing. Nobody pointed. Nobody snitched. Nobody said nothing. And it was a lot of people that didn't see legs throw the biscuit. So at this point, as I'm watching legs walk to her table, I'm like, I'm not hungry no more. <laughs> How about I just go on ahead and tie my shoelaces up and get up out the line? How about that? So I went on ahead. I get out the line. So I see Jazz. She's looking at me. She like, I know somebody knows something. She hitting her. I'm like, oh, she mad. She big man. So I go to the table and I sit with legs. So legs laugh like, <laughs> I'm like, why you do? Why you threw a biscuit? Why you do that? She like, cause she trying to bully you. She like, cause she wrote on your locker. And if the principal come to you and see that, that's on your locker, you going to get in trouble and you going to get fined and you might get kicked out of security for vandalizing the property. First off, time out. I didn't even do it, Steven. How am I going to get vandalized? I didn't do that. Like, I didn't vandalize this. How am I get a fine for that? So she ended up telling me this situation where she ended up writing on this girl locker and end up the girl ended up getting fined and the girl ended up telling her legs ended up getting in trouble because the girl actually went to the principal and finally told. So I sat back in the back of my head and was like, man, legs been here for a while. Like your plan is to get out. The alternative skew, not stay in there for everybody generations, not sit and chill, not marinate in an alternative skew. Who wants to be there? You want to graduate and you want it. And if you can't graduate from there, you at least want them to put you in a school where you can graduate from. So you can say you walk the stage. So for you to be here that long, I was like, so wait. How long you been? She like, for a couple of years. A couple of years. She like, yeah, but I keep getting kicked out. So I had to come back. And I'm like, why you just won't stop? So now I'm like, I went from, ha, 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 you threw the biscuit to, oh, my God. You probably finna get kicked out again. And mind you, she got kicked out last year due, due because of me. So I was like, okay, she's messy. But in my mind, I'm like, but why would she throw the biscuit at her. So I'm asking her, like, but, but why would you do it? She like, because she trying to bully you. Don't let her bully you. And you said her brother came up here. I'm like, yeah. I'm like, this is second time. She was like, and he probably going to be waiting for you. You know what I'm saying? At the skew. So I'm like, I, I, I don't even know my brother. Like, friends, numbers, by heart. So she like, we can go to his skew. I'm like, wait, and ditch it? No, I'm not ditching. I just got out the hot seat. I just get out the hot seat of that I ditched, okay? And it was it was with you. Like, last thing we want to do, last thing we want to do is my mama come up to the skew 
and really pop off like it's the 4th of July. She already attempted to take my family. She gave it back. Like, we, I'm not trying to be in the hot seat. I like being chill. She's been letting me out. I've been getting a little L. So I'm trying to at least keep on to what I can do the most. Like, even if I can't do it for hours and hours, at least I can go outside now. I'm not a prisoner in my own home. I got a bed. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Mark is in trouble, but I'm, I'm a little bit scot-free. So I'm like, I'm thinking a little bit before I do this time. So I'm like, no, I'm not, I'm, I'm not going to ditch to come back. And what if we get caught? She's like, we're not going to get caught. Now, my, of course she know the ins and outs. She been here for some couple of years. Of course, you know the ins and outs, Missy. So I'm telling her straight up like, no, no. I'm like, um, I'm going to call my friend. So first thing I thought about was Roy and Raymond. So I'm like, I'm going to call Raymond first. So I end up like, I got to leave the cafeteria because the cafeteria was really loud, right? So I end up going straight to the door. It's two security guards, like, right there. So they're like, uh, where you going? I'm like, I need to go to the bathroom. They're like, the bill's going to ring in a couple of minutes. You don't want to wait? I'm like, I can't wait. I got to do number two. Yeah, but the, you can hold it. I'm like, I, I can't. I've been holding it since the whole line. So I'm like, please, please, like. I have, I'm gonna boo boo myself. So he like, all right. So he opened up the door and I go straight to the bathroom, straight up. Boom. I end up calling Raymond. Raymond picks up. I'm like, hey, where you at? He like watching a movie in my room about to smoke. I'm like, bro, can you please, you know what I'm saying? Like, stop at the skew. He like, what's wrong? I'm like, so this girl, her brother, he keep approaching me. This is the second time. And I'm like, it seems like he trying to, you know what I'm saying? Like, he trying to fight me. So he like, all right. He like, what time you get out? So I tell him. And so he like, I'll be there. I'm like, man, and I don't know none of Mark friends' numbers. He like, you want me to go try to get him? I'm like, no, 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 no. Because I don't know how my mama going to be operating. Because mind you, my mama taking him to skew. He already in trouble for ditching. He's sleeping outside in the tent. What if my mama just kicking it out? My mama was the type that to kick it out in front of the school just to catch you, to see if you're going to sneak out or anything like that. So, uh, no. I was like, no, no, no. Don't worry, don't worry. I'm like, just come straight to the school. He's like, all right, boom. So I end up, I call Roy. Blee, 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 blee. The bell rings. Everybody come. You hear, oh, yeah, ah, ah, ah. So you hear somebody like, go through that biscuit. So I'm like, I'm in the bathroom. I'm in the bathroom and I hear this. I'm like, oh, it's about to go down. So I'm like, please, we're not picking him. I'm getting his voicemail. I'm getting a little operator lady. So I call again, call again, call again. I'm calling this dude like, pick up. Pick up the phone. I need you. I wonder what I need you. He's not picking up. I come out the bathroom, right? So I hear, whoever threw that biscuit, I promise you, I'm going to smack the dog out of you. I'm going to smack you. Straight up. I'm going to smack you. I'm going to pull you by your hair and I'm going to drag you in the school. You don't know me like that. Nobody know me like that. So she talking about what area she from. She throwing up her set. She talking about what area she from. She like, ah, cool. So she's kicking like, hey, 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 hey. Just go to your locker. Go to your locker. Because she in the middle of the hallway yelling. He like, if you keep on, he like, I'm going to take you to the office. So she finally calmed down. So legs come to my locker, right? Now, mind you, legs locker is up on the next floor. So legs come. Legs like, oh, so she, they saying she's saying something tough. I'm like, calm down. I'm like, I don't know. I'm like, but she really mad. She like, love me, man. She like, I beat that. Ooh. Like, she snapping. I beat her. Like, she snapping. She popping. I'm like, just chill. So, Julia come over there to my lock. He like, yo. He like, we got three minutes before the bear ring. I'm like, okay. So, he like, I want y'all to see something. He like, it's cool beings. I'm like, where is it? He like, on the football field. So Liz like, all right, come on. So boom, I grab my, my study books for the next class. Now, mind you, in the next class is me, Junior, Jazz, it's all of us. Piper is all of us going in this, you know what I'm saying, in this class. So I'm like, all right, we got three minutes. So the time ticket. So as soon as we leave out, it's people on the football field. We go by the bleachers. I'm like, what are we doing? He like, no, we got to go under it. I'm like, under the, ble under the bleachers? Like, why are we going under the bleachers? So he goes under the bleachers, boom, he flames up a 
fat Snoop Doggy Dog joint. It's fatter than a red. It's pregnant, y'all. <laughs> like, y'all my family. I'm letting y'all know. Something small and fat, I was like, yo, yeah, it's him. He passing to me. I'm I'm too busy, like, just memorized of it's fat and small. So I'm like, hurry up, hurry up. He like, we got a minute and a half. So I'm like, a minute and a half? Like, what? He like, come on, just, just. I'm like, I'm like, mm -hmm. I'm coughing my lungs. He like just passing you coughing. I'm like, oh, so legs in it, he in it. We just boom. We missed the bell by a little bit. Security guard getting the shut door. We like, hey, hey. He like, well, come on, come on. We go in and he like, y'all been smoking? So he like, no, nah, my brother just dropped us off. We went to the gas station. He was smoking. So I'm like, security guard didn't even say nothing, bro. So I'm like, if I would have said that. I would have been possibly sent to the office with my mama being called. But I'm like, okay, cool, whatever. We getting ready to go to our class. So you, as we get in our class, you hear Jazz like, yeah, somebody, straight up, she's she's telling Junior, like, somebody hit me with a biscuit, blah, blah, blah. So Piper like, what? You know, like Piper talking to her. So the teacher come in like, all right, guys, today is pop quiz day. So today... We're going to be quiet as we do this pop quiz. I will only give you a calculator. Yes, a calculator, because it's going to be a part where you have to do math. Now, if you're good, you don't have to use a calculator. If you don't have a number two pencil, raise your hand, right? No, I did not have a number two pencil. I just had a pencil. So I'm like, I want to raise my hand, but I'm not. I won't use a pencil. So boom. He ends up passing it to whoever. We end up getting our, our pop quiz. So it's quiet, you know, the first few minutes. And I'm like, oh, my God. Like, And it's stuff that we originally had. So I'm like, man. Okay, I don't know. So now I'm guessing. So I'm bubbling in this multiple choice. I'm bubbling in. So the teacher, he's walking. So it's like chairs like boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. So it's like four rows. Boom, boom, boom. So it's chairs, right? in a row so he comes he like Roshan I'm like yes he like is that a number two pencil I'm like oh that's a pencil he like but is is it number two I'm like what you mean so he like it should say number two on your pencil I'm like oh no so he Took the pop quiz, yo. This is the first time I ever seen this man get a goon status. Gutter. He, <laughs> Joey wigged out on me. He took the test in front of everybody. And he like, guys, when you don't listen, this will happen to your quiz. That's a very important grade. And he balled it up. So I stood up. I said, hey. I said, are you going to give me another quiz? He like, no. I told you to let me know if you didn't have a number two pencil and I will be calling your parents and I will be reporting this to the office and I will be letting your counselor and your dean know. And I'm like, in my mind, you doing this over a pencil? So I was like, I'm sorry, I, I didn't know. He like, well, if you wasn't for sure, Roshan, you should have raised your hand and I would have still gave you a number two pencil. I cannot take your quiz with any other pencil but other. So he was really strict about the number two pencil. So now I'm sitting there. I'm in class and I'm mad. And I have no quiz. Everybody quizzing. So Junior looking like. He was like, hey, I think you're a trip bank. So he's like, who said that? So I'm like, he like, Roshan, did you say that? I'm like, no. So Junior like, no, no, no. I said it. I just, I just think you're tripping. Like, just go on over here we just, and give another test. And so he like. You're not the teacher. If you want to teach this class, you want to grade these papers. So I'm like, I never really seen him have, you know, big jugglers down there. I mean, his jock bus was big that day. So I'm like, oh, this man making me mad. So I'm like, it's fine. I don't care. Like, you can fail me. Give me an F. Now, I'm mad. He's like, if you talk back, I'm going to kick you out the class. And you can wait outside in the hallway. And I, the security guards can deal with you. Because you shouldn't be in the hallway. Now, how would you like it, Roshan? I'm like... I didn't say anything. He like, you have a lot to say, but you don't have a number two pencil. So I look, he like, 
and you trying to get out of here. He like, this going to affect your grade. And he just said that he sat down and he put his glasses on. So I'm like, <sighs> so Julian like, hey, don't worry. I'm like, you trying to film me. So Liz like, <gasps> hey, who hit you with that biscuit? So I look. So Liz like, somebody hit you with a biscuit. I'm like, so she like, yeah, you know who? She like, yep, I do. So you hear the teacher. He like, hey, hey, no talking or I will take your quizzes. So you hear tip, 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 at, the, at the teacher's door. So he like, I'll be back. No talking. No sharing answers. So he's saying no talking, no sharing answers. He's really big on just get the quiz done. He wants you to do the uh, legit answer. So boom, he end up going straight outside the door. Tell me why. As this man leave, Legs was like, it was me that threw the biscuit. So she said, it was what? She get, Jazz gets up out her chair, picks up the chair, picks up the whole desk, the desk that stuck to the chair. He picked, bro, picks it up. She picks it up. And run towards legs and throw the chair, the whole desk. The whole desk. So Julia's like, oh man, everybody gets up. Everybody gets up, right? And so legs are like, did you leg straight grab the she said, Did you just throw the desk? She grabbed her. Boom, they up there scrapping. But when I say jazz, had them hands, the fisty cups. It was hitting all over different. She comes over there, bop, bop, bop. She got her head down. She like, put your legs like, put your head up. Buckle, buckle. She like, I got it. Boop, boop. So she grabbed legs by the hair and get the pulling. She get, Joe, get the pulling legs by the hair. By the hair. She get the pulling her, Joe. Dragging her, so you she's dragging her through the dances though. So people are like, oh, so Julia like chill, chill. So she legs like, let me go. So legs like, let me go. That she like, mm -mm, mm -mm. she steady pulling legs like, whoo, grab her somehow, move the arms, whoo, put her in a circle. So she boom got her in a headlock. That was pressure. That was because how did you reverse that? That was pressure. The teacher come in, hey, hey, hey. He's trying to break it up. He like, somebody go get the security guards. He telling one of one of us to go get the security guards. So I'm like, no. Nah. So he like, I'm not talking to you. Somebody go get the security guard. So the girl, she leaves out the one of the other doors. She goes grab the security guard. Security guard comes in, broke up the fight. Liz got a scratch right here. The girl jazz, she got a scratch right here. Her hair is wild. Everything looked crazy. They both had a good one. Roy Rump. So you hear Jazz like, it's not over. I'm going to see you at the ski rules. So security like, ain't nobody's not seeing nobody. She's like, bring Roshan. Bring Roshan. Why, why bring me? Why bring me? Don't bring me. I don't want you to bring me. What did I do? Go away. Go away. That was between you and legs. So boom, they end up going to bed ring. Bing. So as the bed ring, I check my phone. Rena called me back. I call Roy. He pick up. I'm like, yo, I need you to come to the ski. Like, you have to come. He like, why? What's going on? He like, what's the address? I don't, I don't fully know the address. I'm like, um, I, I got you. I'll send it to you. But I'm like, my friend, he's coming. Like, he's coming. I just need you to come with him. He like, all right. I'm like, look, I'm going to give you his number. So I give him Raymond number. I call Raymond. Let Raymond know the T. Boom. Raymond got everything locked down. They going to be. Oh, the way they're gonna be on the way so i ain't really really tripping about it so soon as I, I go like out the bathroom right come back out the bathroom i see legs and i see jazz they coming out the office so they splitting up so jazz look at me she like like what like what does it like what did i do like no what did i do no please don't put me in this so immediately i go to the office i'm like can i speak with the principal so the the counselor like yeah of course so he like hey roshan he like is everything going fine i'm like yes um i have a problem he like what's your problem i'm like well it's a situation 
that happened and this girl she wrote on my locker because i didn't want to get kicked out i didn't want to start over and i don't got time for that so he like could you tell me who and i was like yeah i could tell you so once i gave him the name he like wait she just got out of a fight he like okay I, I i'll figure something out thanks for telling me i walks off as i walk off legs and jazzes in the hallway together <laughs>